Hi everyone, this message is about being nice, but make sure it's truthful. My friend uh, Lani inspired this message. She said, you should do one on how people should talk nicely and not rubbish talk. Well, the Bible says something about that. It says in Ephesians 4.15, it says, Alerteu on desenagape, which says, be speaking truthfully in love. Now, it's not talking about being in love with everyone. It's talking about being loving. And it's saying we should be speaking truth lovingly. Now, I think as a society, Western society is pretty nice. They're getting pretty good at being nice to people. But to the extent these days that they, they will say things that are not true in order to be nice and not offend. Now, that's wrong. We should actually be speaking the truth. And in fact, this modern society has rejected God's ways and instead of making up ways of their own in which they say things like all human beings are born free and equal in dignity and rights. Now, that's actually rubbish. That's not true. We're not born equal. No two humans are equal in any way. In any way that you can measure two people, they will not be equal. They will be different. And we're not equal in dignity either. In the, in the eyes of the Creator, we are told by Him we are to honor our father and our mother, which means elevating them and lifting them up and looking up to them. So we can't be saying, we're equal to you, mum and dad. That's wrong. We've got to have the creator's view of things if we're going to be truthful. And we should be saying things if we don't know if it's truthful. So if it's something that we, we don't know about, we should be waiting to find out what God says about that. And then we'll know what is the truth to say. And we not, won't be talking rubbish because there's a lot of people talking rubbish these days. They say rubbish like even that a man can marry a man or a woman can marry a woman. Now that's rubbish. That's nonsense. That's not what the Creator wants. He wants a man to marry a woman, not a man to marry a man. And he actually says for a man to be with a man, to lie with a man, is actually a hated thing in his sight. So it's very important that we're speaking truthfully and not just saying what makes people feel good. Let's say, th let's say the truth and make sure that we say it in a way that is easier to accept or is nice and, and respectful of people. Tell them the truth. Otherwise, we'll lead them in the wrong path and they'll end up suffering for it. So speak the truth in love. That's what the message is today. And thanks, Lani, for encouraging me to put this on.